Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I'm like super duper stressed and like when I get stressed I have to take, do something to get my mind off this. So I'm just going to do a Q&A and let you guys get to know, let you guys get to know a little bit more about me. That's probably not making any sense in English, but my computer is pretty much like not working. So I'm using my mom's computer to try to find Q&A questions. I don't have any subscribers. Well, I don't have any like people to like give me questions. So what should I type up? I'm just going to type up questions no one ask yep questions no one okay one ask q and a let me just say questions no one ask i'm sick and tired um okay it says 50 deep questions nobody asks asks i hate that word asks or ask asks like why is the SKS like that like <sighs> I'm so annoyed with it. anyone cannot tell but anyways let's get on into this video my like intro thing will not play because YouTube is like being really extra right now and like I don't we just finished watching John Wick 2 so yeah I want to see John Wick 3 so bad but I don't know when we're gonna go see it but hopefully it's soon but basically, um, like I said, I'm going to answer like as many of these questions as I can within like 15 minutes or so because that's like I need that much time or whatever. I don't know what I'm trying to say. But yeah, let's get on into the video. So the first question says, where did you grow up? Um, I grew up in Augusta, Georgia, and I'm from Augusta, Georgia. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The earliest memory I have of like what? Like that question is so not good. Um... What would you do with the money if you won the lottery? Well, first of all, I would buy me a car, well, either a Jeep or a Hummer, because I've been wanting that car for like ever. Like that's one of my like dreams and goals in lives, in lives, in life is to get a Hummer or a Jeep. I love like the Jeep Saharas, like the Rubicons. Oh my gosh, those are like, I love them so much. And then Hummers, the H3 Hummer. I just love Hummers, so I just need a Hummer in my life, too. Um, I would probably do that. Yeah, that's just the first thing I would do. If you had to wear one item forever, what would it be? Honestly, probably my Houston Rockets jacket. And, like, I say this because I've been wearing this jacket since, like, the 7th or 8th grade, ever since I got it for, like, Christmas, because... I don't know if you guys know, but like before my YouTube channel was like my name, it was Miss Howard because I'm like so obsessed with Dwight Howard. Like it's not even like funny or whatever. But like I've been like in love with Dwight Howard since like the sixth grade, like not even joking, like this is so serious. We're like six years strong or whatever. But like the very, very first thing I actually started following him was when he was um a Rockets. When he played for the Rockets. Like I knew of him when he played for the Lakers, but then when he got traded to the Rockets, I was just like, ooh. So like that's when I got my first what do you call it like cons not concession that's when i got like my first thing of dwight howard's i don't know how to so i would probably wear that jacket 24 7 because i just like the way it fits on me and how it feels and like i've been and like like i said i've been wearing it since like the sixth or well since like the seventh or eighth grade and now i'm a senior in high school and i'm still wearing the jacket to school so like if anyone asks like why i wear that jacket to school still that's the reason why because i love it and no one can like, tell me what to do because i just do whatever i want to do so that's the tea mm -hmm. what cartoons do you still watch I don't really watch cartoons I don't, know. I don't know what the cartoon like really is I don't know I don't know what is a weird combination of food that you where is wow what is a weird food combination that I do I don't know the answer to that question honestly like what weird food see I don't think my food combinations are weird so I'm not the good person I'm not the best person to ask that what are three things you know that's these questions are so boring like ew <sighs> favorite moment in history i don't know pet koala or pet panda pet i like both of them so a koala panda i don't know my usual bedtime this is like a thing my usual see okay my usual bedtime like i would only fall asleep around like 11 or 12 o'clock at night but like my eyes like if i'm out somewhere like even during prom like people could see it during prom or whatever like at 10 o'clock p.m. like I don't care where I like 
around like like U.S. standard time Eastern zone. I don't I don't know what zone I am. I really don't know. Like I really don't. <sighs> whatever zone I'm on, or whatever 10 p.m. Like my eyes just like start to just like water, and I just like get tired, and I'm just like tired. So that's just my no. I can normally fall asleep. I normally fall asleep around 11 or 12, but my eyes fall asleep around like 10 o'clock p.m. Like on the dot. Last movie I watched, John Wick. Um, would you say you have more of an English brain than a math brain? It's oh, a really good question. I don't know the answer to, because I, at this point, I literally hate both subjects. So, do you mind getting famous if you're in this bad publicity? No. If I'm going to become famous for something, it better be because I did something great or because. I worked my way up to that success. I'm not going to become famous over something that I did. Like, no. Would you ever go on a blind date? Uh, maybe? I guess? I don't know. Um, last movie that made me cry, definitely Avengers Endgame. I'm not going to spoil anything because I don't know if anyone's seen it. I, I at least try to get people like two months, three months before I spoil or whatever. Because like not everyone like has the money to like go see it right away. But the end of Avengers Endgame made me cry. So yeah, that's the two of that. Is this question tag over? Are you serious? What the heck? Oh my gosh. What do you remember to be the worst day you've ever had? Hmm. I don't really know. My mind is just like so blocked from like stress. I just can't think right now. So this is probably not a good time to do Q&A, but I just trying to get not stressed. So yeah. Something silly I believe as a child. I remember my dad told me that like, if you kiss somebody that that's how you got pregnant or some funny story about that. That was funny. That's something I believe that was silly as a child. Um, favorite fictional word? I don't know most significant event of my life these questions are so hard i'm so mad like i do q a so i don't have to think and i still have to think either eat or drink your calories i'd rather drink rather eat than not drink i don't like drinking stuff would you rather the world remain peaceful forever or no one on earth goes hungry well honestly like in the state that we are right now the world's never going to become peaceful, even though I, like I hope it becomes. I'm like a I'm like a hopeless peaceful, a peaceful like, like you know if people say hopeless romantic like hope hopeful peaceful like, that's not a word. I just made that up. Just don't listen to me. So I'd rather no one on earth would go hungry because, in my opinion, like no one being no one starving and like them getting like the nutrition they need is better than like us trying to remain peaceful because that's just not going to work at this point. Um, what show do you watch that isn't targeted for your age group? I don't really know. Don't really know. See, I watch like Doctor Show. I watch like The Resident, The Good Doctor, Grey's Anatomy, Chicago Med. I just started watching that. Pretty good show. Like other Doctor shows, I that's really all I watch at this point. So, yeah. I am just so like not together let's try to find some more questions because these questions literally suck like i cannot tmi too much info oh this is too much information tag this may be interesting too much information oh my gosh biggest turn off in a person oh my gosh this is a good question i hate when people smell like smoke do drugs like I don't that's just the, the thing when someone smells like drugs or smoke or like anything like that or like I see them doing it or like they say they do it it's just like ew like you can be the cutest person in the world but if I see or like hear that you do that it's just like nah. not, um I wait this at what age did you have your first kiss no age zero what not zero because I'm not alive at zero. But like I haven't had my first kiss yet, so that's great. Do I smoke? Yeah. Sorry, my sister just like called my phone and she kinda interrupted what I was having going on. Um, I think the question was do you miss anyone right now? Yes, my dad. A lot. Um, so you're not how you've been cheated on? No, because I've never I've never been in a relationship, so 
heck? You can't cheat if you've never been in a relationship. I mean, you can't get cheated on too. Have you ever lied to get out of trouble? Yes, of course. Who hasn't? Oh my gosh, these are like dirty questions. How tall am I? I don't know. If you could bring a person back from the dead, who would you bring back? My dad. If you could choose a Disney princess to be your best friend, who would you choose? <sighs> hmm. I would choose Aurora. I think that's the name of Sleeping Beauty to be my best friend. I don't know. Why? Because I don't know. Um wow these you guys are really not getting to know me because i'm just like not answering the questions so i don't know why um most disgusting habit i have oh my gosh i hate all these freaking questions most disgusting feature i have mm. I mean, disgusting habit I have. Oh my gosh, I cannot think. Like this, my mind is so blocked right now. Best gift, best gift I've ever received: a Chick Fil A gift card. Chick Fil A gift card. Biggest fear? I don't know. Last text I sent? I don't know. My birthday is April twenty eighth. Celebrity crush? Definitely Dwight Howard. But then again, I also like um Chris Hensworth who plays Thor. He's like really hot. And then the dude who plays John Wick and John Wick is really cute too at this point. So yeah. Yeah. Um, wow. I'm sorry. This video seems like so boring, but it's really not. Um, I'm actually probably really good. So I don't know. These questions are not like good questions. Like why? I'm so annoyed at this point because I'm not getting good questions like whatsoever. I should have just like asked my sisters to make me questions or something because this is not working. I'm really clearly confused. Also, oh my gosh, guys, the James Charles thing that's going on right now. Like I watched the whole 41 minute video, but apparently Jeffrey saying it's not true. He's like, this always decides every story, whatever. But like, I'm just going to sit here and just say like, I'm glad James Charles made that 41 minute video. Like, as soon as Tati made her video, like, that was 43 minutes long, I was just like, James Charles, just make a video, like, talking about everything that she announced in that video, and just, like, like, fight for yourself, like, defend yourself, because half the stuff, like, everyone lies, like, Tati is not telling the truth 24-7, and neither is James Charles, but, like, I'm just glad that he made, I mean, I don't know if they're, like, lying or telling the truth, but, like, I would like to think that, like, they are telling the truth, but, like, we know, like, there's two sides to every story, and nine times out of ten, people don't tell the truth 24-7. Do you like to use post-it notes? Yes. Do you cut coupon coupons but never use them? Yeah. Biggest pet peeve. When people ignore me when I'm talking to them and they don't look at my face. That's annoying. That's really annoying. Do you ever count your steps when you walk? Nope, but I probably will start because now it's in my mind. Have you ever peed or pooped in the woods? No. Do you chew your pens and pencils? No. I've never done that. That's just disgusting. When I see someone do that, I'm just like... Is it okay for guys to wear pink? It's 2019. And wear whatever you want. I don't really don't care. Song of the Week. Wow by Post Malone. W is W dot O dot W. I think it's another dot. By Post Malone. I like that song. What do you dip a chicken nugget in? Um, barbecue sauce or sweet and sour sauce? I like that. Do I still watch cartoons? Yes, but I don't know which cartoons I still watch. Because like, I'm really confused. Were I, was I ever a boy or girl scout? Nope. Would I ever strip or pose nude in a magazine? Never, ever in my life would I do that. Not even how, not even if I had the body or something for it. I would never do that because why? Are you stubborn? Definitely. Do you sing in the car? Yep. Am I afraid of heights? No, but like I don't like to be up high for very long, so. Do you sing in the shower? Yep. Who doesn't? That's the real question. Favorite type of fruit pie? Um, I don't like fruit pies. Actually, yeah, I don't like, actually, no, apples aren't a fruit. Wait, 
apple is a fruit shoot apple pie did i seriously just say that apple's not a fruit my favorite fruit pie is apple pie occupations you want to be when you i was when you were a kid i wanted to be i don't know i don't know what i wanted to be when i was a kid i was just really not confused kid but like i don't know what i wanted to be when i was a kid i'm really like i can't even think about what i wanted to be like two years ago like i just don't but i do know that now i want to be an orthopedic surgeon specializing in sports medicine and that's like a long little phrase but i just knew that like ever since like i guess freshman well actually no ever since sophomore year like freshman year i was like oh my god i want to be a lawyer so bad and then i was just like i'm not into history i'm not into law that much or whatever so i'm just like this is not for me but then i started watching so many doctor shows and stuff and i started watching like not like surgeries but like i started getting into like surgeries and stuff and like reading up about it and stuff like that i'm just like mm, this is kind of interesting so i'm just like i know i want to do something in the medical field and then also i'm really interested in sports but like i knew i didn't want to be like a sports marketer a sports marketer or like a new sports marketer or whatever but i'm just like mm. so like sports and medicine like that's gonna go together like oh so sports medicine so i took a sports medicine class this year my senior year in high school and like i absolutely loved it and i found out about like orthopedic surgery from like that class and like other stuff like that and then i found out you can specialize in like a certain like subject or like topic or like you can specialize in a certain theme for like orthopedic surgery so yeah for orthopedic surgery i found out it's like, it's like the number one most competitive like surgeon job or whatever you get paid like heck of money that's crazy but like, honestly money's not the reason why i'm going in the medical field i'm just really going in the medical field because i feel like i want to do something with my hands like so bad like i just want to like go inside somebody's body and just like fix it it just sounds interesting it's probably not the best explanation i've ever said about like surgery or whatever but like that's just the best that i could like give you at this point but yeah um so you did kind of find out something about me Am I a pencil? What? That says, are you patient? Okay. Um, ever won a contest? Nope. Do I want to have kids? Maybe. No. No. Do I have kids? No. Favorite color? Pink. Do you miss plastic surgery? Which are better, black or green olives? Neither. What kind of question is that? Oh my gosh. Knit or crochet? I can't do either one of those. Best room for a fireplace? <sighs> Probably living room. I want to get married yeah high school crush mm, not saying it because I'm still in high school but I'll say it probably like when I get into college or whatever I'll probably say it then because like then they won't really care but I do have well, many crushes that I've had in high school I have had many crushes in high school what do you drink with dinner water okay another thing soda okay I used to be so obsessed with soda like Sprite and stuff but I feel like I've drunk it too much or like I haven't drank that's not a word i feel like i've either had too much spray or i haven't had enough in like the past few months that i've just gotten like kind of not wanted it and i had spray for the first time again at mcdonald's like a few days ago or whatever and like i think it was yesterday or like friday one of those days and i just like hated it like just the carbonation going down like i know everyone says the carbonation like it's so bad like honestly the carbonation like like it just makes me burp or like hiccup or whatever you want to call it and just doesn't feel good in my throat so i just don't drink it anymore i don't drink a lot of spray okay so this is clearly not going very well so i'm just gonna end this video here and like try to attempt to again clean my room up well not clean my room pack my room up because it really needs to get packed because we're moving in like three weeks and i am ready to move so bad like i'm just ready for this to be over I hate the moving process i hate packing up things i hate loading them into a truck and then having to unload it back and then put it back in another room it just turns out to do it now and then i have to do it when i go to college i'm so annoyed i just i just want to pull my hair out but anyways guys remember to um be nice to yourself because you're doing the best that you can and i'll talk to you guys in the next video bye love you guys